Mao Zedong Microbiography by Alyssa Thompson. Mao was born as a poor farmer in Shaoshan, Hunan Province, China. As he grew, his father became a wealthy grain dealer. Because of this, Mao was able to go to a college. In 1976, Mao Zedong died. Some allies of Mao called themselves the Gang of Four and tried for power, but they failed. A year later, Deng Xiaoping became leader. This led to a new era in China. Mao had two wives. Yang Ke was a teacher's daughter and was killed by the nationalists. Zhang King was Mao's follower at all times and before they married was a well-known movie actress. She played a very important role during the Cultural Revolution. In 1950, China participated in the Korean War. Fighting with Korea helped Korea win and Tibet became part of China. This expanded China's land by a couple hundred acres of land. On February 12, 1911, the last king emperor, Pu Yi, abdicated the throne at the imperial palace. The defeaters were the Revolutionary Army. The nationalists came together with the communists and fought Japan so that they would not take over China. Both the communists and the nationalists must have really wanted Japan to lose because the communists and nationalists were, en were enemies working together. That time, they fought together, not against. The communists were in charge when the nationalists announced that they wanted to have a different government than the communists. The first ruler of the nationalists had agreed with the same government, and then a different ruler came and they disagreed. The communists ended up winning the war against the communists and the nationalists. The long march took place from October 1934 to October 1935, lasting one year. It was a 6,000-mile retreat done because the nationalists were going to attack them. Sadly, 80,000 people went, but only a tenth of them survived. People got so hungry that they ate their leather shoes and they had to walk in straw sandals. The Great Leap Forward took place in 1958, going on for five years. It was a time of famine and starvation with labor-intensive industry. It was intended to modernize China, and it failed, bringing China down more than up. It can also be known as the Great Leap Backward. On October 1, 1949, Mao Zedong proclaimed the People's Republic of China. Mao became the leader, sending the nationalists to Taiwan. He ruled until his death in 1976.